This is your room thermostat. You can press any button to light up the display. The big number is telling you what the temperature is inside the room currently. The small number is the temperature that we're aiming for. We can change the target temperature just by pressing the up and down arrows. If the temperature at the top is less than the temperature at the bottom, the heating will go off. If the temperature at the top is greater than the temperature at the bottom, the heating will come on and you'll see a little flame light up above the big number. We've got a series of buttons at the bottom. We can change it from auto to manual by pressing the button underneath where it says auto to manual. If you have, have it set to manual, whatever you change the target temperature to, it will stay like that forever until you change it back, back or until you change it back to automatic. If you're going away, you can press the off button and it will set the thermostat to five degrees so the thermostat will come on to prevent anything from freezing if the house does get too cold. The menu button is where we can set the program or we can change the time. So if the clocks have gone back and you need to change the time, we can go through and change the time. So to change the program, we go to program, we press the OK button. It asks you Monday to Friday, or we can change it to Saturday and Sunday. And we can then go in to change the program. We can press the up and down buttons to cycle through the on and off periods. So for example, if we're coming on at 6.30, it's 21 degrees, we can go to number two. The temperature at nine o'clock will set back to 18 degrees. Temperature at six o'clock will rise back to 21. And at 11 o'clock, it will then set back. I'm gonna change this one. So it's asking number four, do you wanna change? Yes. And I'm gonna change the temperature down to 12 degrees for the nighttime temperature, okay. Now, should you have any problems with the heating, the first thing you want to try to look at is the batteries so we can take the batteries out by just clicking down and you see two AA batteries they can be changed the first thing you want to try the batteries generally last about two years 